Welcome back, you guys. Your boy CK, and it's time for another episode of the Elite Exchange Pack and Play. Looking to wreak havoc on the field with Terrell Pryor, and on defense, we got Levante David, Vince Wolfork. It's time for the first game. Now, along with those two elites that I just mentioned, is Garrett Reynolds. They are all on the chopping block. So let's get this thing started with a bang. Pull it to the Anthony Thomas. Very next play. Bruh, look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. <laughs> The highest overall blocker on the entire offensive line ends up letting the guy in free. And we throw an interception on the very next play. So not off to a good start in this one. Here we are on defense for the first time. We're getting absolutely embarrassed. Bradley Roby had no chance on that play. Second and 10. We actually get to the quarterback, get our hands on the ball, and we don't pick it off. So you know what that means. He's obviously going to convert this first down. Look at him scrolling out with Mariota. Going to shut off a tackler. Nothing big. Then he's going to swerve by that guy. But then... We get our first Wheel of Packs of the episode, courtesy of Christian Kirksey, getting the first fumble right there. And we get the ball back on offense, looking to put up some points. This time, hopefully, our blockers actually block, and we can move the ball down the field. So first and 10, TP dropping back, throwing an absolute pull it to Jacoby Ford. This time is first and 10. We see Ford open. He sees him too, so we have to try to go to Sammy Coates. He doesn't hold on to it. Second and 10, we try to fullback dive. That doesn't work. Third and six. <laughs> Jacoby Ford getting his first touchdown of the game. So we have the lead here. And here's Anthony Barr getting to the quarterback. Very nice play right there. Fourth and seven. This guy just decided to roll out every single play. But he decided to go to man, and it actually worked right there. So we get the ball back. And I'm not sure you guys notice it yet, but TP and Jacoby Ford are forming this nice little connection. Look at this bullet. He rises up, he goes up, and he gets it. Another touchdown, 14-0 ball game. We're back on defense. We almost get to the quarterback, but instead, he's going to dot me over the top and celebrate into the end zone. So we're only up one possession at this point. Our defense looking kind of suspect, but on offense, everything's firing on all cylinders. Look at that throwaway dot right there. We almost get the first down, second and one. We're going to roll out to the left this time. Beautiful blocking, and who else? Another one, man. Jacoby Ford in for his third touchdown of the game. The guy's unstoppable. No one can seem to cover him. Oh, man. And for some reason, we just forget how to cover as well. So it's only a one possession game. We're back on offense. It's not even halftime yet, man. A very high scoring game. This time it's going to be Sammy Coates with that 95 speed. Getting the first down and then some. First and 10. And that's an absolute pull. Oh, Kobe Fleener this time, man. The speed on this team is unbelievable. For all gold cards, they are all fast, man. I love these campus heroes. Very nice addition to the game by EA. So first and 10. He's going to just chuck it up. That's Jimmy Smith. And that's a terrible attempt at coming down with an interception, man. The ball hits you in the hands. You got to catch it, man. That's what my coach told me back in high school. So second time's the charm, right? No, he drops it again, man. So third and 10, I guess he was tired. I took him out, and I put him to keep to leap. I don't know where he came from, man. I don't know how he ended up on the team. I decided to pitch it back. I don't think he deserved to be in the game. So I tried to get the ball to Nate Allen so he could get the pick six. Obviously, it didn't work out. Anyways, we get the ball back on offense. First and 10. And for the fourth time this game, Jacoby Ford is going to walk in for the touchdown. And my opponent is going to end up rage quitting. So that's the second wheel of packs for this episode, man. And it's time to shift our attention to game number two. We're starting off on a terrible note, as usual. I mean, what else is new? Here we are on defense again. And Jordan Hicks gets us another wheel of packs, man. Beautiful user pick right there. We jumped the route, and we're moving and grooving. He needs some milk. But then DeAnthony Thomas fumbles the ball, man. I can't believe it. We were about to put up some points. And just like that, he's going to go down the field and get an amazing diving animation. He's in the red zone. We're sniffing out the screen, but of course, he decides not to throw it there. And he's in a second and three situation now. We almost jumped the route again. And look at that, man. A big hit. We don't get the fumble animation. So first and goal, you already know he's going to get in for the touchdown. 7-0 ball game, not off to a good start, as I said before, man. So we're going to try and get our other running backs involved. Duke Johnson falls forward, almost picks up the first. We're back to our superstar, DeAnthony Thomas. Just hold on to the ball, man. I'll give you more touches, I promise. First and 10, we're surveying the field with, oh, Terrell Pryor. Look at this move. Look at him shaking off defenders, man, down the sideline. And he caps it off with an amazing swerve on the defensive back. My opponent ends up rage quitting. I don't know if it's because of that. But I'll take it, man. A wheel of packs being added. We have four of those. You guys decide who stays and who goes. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're new. And as for me.